right. All right. So what is it? That's okay. okay. <laughs> um, so what? So that should be. I didn't know what to give. I looked out in the market what I could buy, but I couldn't find any. So I thought of my dad's pate. Is it good? Mm -hmm. yeah, <laughs> you should try good, it. Good. You should try it. I'm sorry, I, 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 I got tempted. So yeah, I wasn't actually. I, I'm not <laughs> listening to you anymore. <laughs> Originally, the idea you. was actually my dad's. Okay, right. he's the he's the one who actually makes the pate in the family, and he's the original mm. pate maker. He's mm -hmm. the one who d d would distribute the pates to f to family and right, friends right, for right. gift giving. And I got that idea of, you know, maybe I can do that right, because right. you know we have. My friends would, would would love it. Yeah, really. So sure. yeah. Are you sure about that? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, and he, I kind of had to, you know, um, pull out from his, um, you know, memory. Right. Because he stopped doing it already. Right, right. So I said, my dad, can you help me out mm -hmm. with the recipe and all that? Right. He doesn't keep recipes. Mm -hmm. So it's like I had to try to make him remember what okay. he would do. And um, buta na lang he did. He right, remembered. Right. Plus the techniques that I borrowed from my sister-in-law, who actually is a teacher in cooking. <laughs> Here's so, a picture. Now you're able to give your friends uh, the the wine, plus yes. plus the uh, the pate. Yes. So how? how what can, can, you, can you tell us the reaction? Do you know that the pate became actually the main gift, and not anymore the wine. Oh. I'm not making yaba. I'm not bragging. It's really because. Yeah, I'm sure. If I were a, <laughs> you're, uh, if I were a guest, probably would say the same thing. Yeah, that's what happened. And then um, people started, um, you know, like I would put my sticker in there and, mm -hmm. and, and my number, and people started calling, ordering, and ordering. Um, not only for Christmas. It was mm -hmm. like I think the recipients, those people who started to give out um, my pate for Christmas. That's yeah, who exactly. who tried calling me after. Mm -hmm. So this um, this pate. Um, holiday gift idea became an all year round thing for right. me. Right. Um, does your husband any take on this? Oh yes. He's my food critic. Oh. He likes to he likes to eat and criticize. <laughs> so, you know, before I can come came up with a pate, it took a lot of um, tests. You know, yeah. and um, to come up with. I'm sure. I'm sure. And uh, would that uh, test uh, be like six months or so? No, not that long. Not that long. Not that long. What My was husband the first... is constantly. No, you gotta do this. You gotta add more this. You know, not only my it, my it's my dad who had to give me the thumbs up, the mm -hmm. approval first because he's the original pate maker, right? Right, right. And then my my husband who just ate and ate and ate, and then later <laughs> on he said, "Why don't you, Carol, do other variants?" Mm -hmm. It was his idea for me to come up not with my just with a classic pate but with the other special uh, special pates which right, right. you know i think that's how my business grew yeah exactly you know? but but uh, uh, it, this is something that they can just that they can get from you um i yes of course they can call me anytime for mm -hmm. orders right. again i i don't i don't do it commercially mm -hmm. okay i do not produce to stock up i don't Why? do that um, for me, it's a business that I run from home, mm -hmm. okay, and I chose to do it. And then I still have my time with my family. I don't want to be, um, I don't want to keep making a lot and to do it in a commercial, you know what I mean? It's like volume. I just want to keep it, actually, I, the reason why I keep it small and I do it upon order is so that I can maintain the freshness of the product. Yeah, exactly. I but always but make should, the, should, should the, the time uh, come that you really need to uh, produce in volume, would you do it? Um, yes, I would. Yes, I would. Um, for, if, if um, what I do is, um, what, what happens is they call, um, they 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 call upon um, order if right, they want right. for their own personal consumption, and I always mm -hmm. tell them that there's a lead time right, for right. cooking, and it's very important for me so I can schedule. I, I, I'm um, sure there are a lot of, of moms uh, watching watching the show, and uh, probably there are some spare time that you know they can just utilize. Uh, would you recommend to to find uh, something else that they can actually do? Moms. Yeah. Okay. Um. Well, if they're good in the kitchen, okay. If they're good in the kitchen and they have spare time while the kids are in school, mm -hmm. and they have some kind of a specialty, it, let's say for example cake or pastries, why not? Right. 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 But if this is something that you will have to train yourself, or this is somehow uh, an inborn thing. Oh, um, I have own. to practice. I am not really a chef, chef. Yeah. But it's I only make something that I enjoy eating. 
and what I would, what my friends would enjoy eating. That's why I kind of like capitalized on that. Yeah. Pardon okay. me for, for, for doing this, but I really ha would have to, <laughs> to take this. So what, what do you call this one? Okay, that is my, I brought for, for your show, I brought two kinds. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think this is my, this is my classic. classic. This is my original pate. I call it the classic chicken liver pate. Okay. Pate, you, you, um, pate is actually a mixture of uh, meat and fat, and um, you combine it into a, mm -hmm. a spreadable paste. This okay. is great. You like really? it? Yeah. Oh, so that's, I'm not listening that's my, to you anymore. <laughs> that's the original one, of course. I had to this come one? up with a special one. Okay, the special okay. one. Okay, this one is the same. It's um, it's the it's the same chicken liver um, base. But but I had to spice it up with. Ooh. Some um, additional herbs, and I doubled up the liquors. I, I, I liquor? Yes. Oh my God. With no, <laughs> the second one. Where no, no, no. Before? Actually, no, no, no. It's it's not nakakalaseng. In fact, um, the original, the first one is actually um, kids. Mm -hmm. I um, people, moms actually buy it for their right, right. for their children. For the second one, it, it's I don't know how, how. What do you think? It's it's a bit more. Peppery. Yeah, this is yeah. This has some some additional taste, of course. This one is re yeah really more a classic side. <laughs> this one is uh, and kind of a hilo hilo na. <laughs> but but interesting. So um, do do you do, do you plan to to expand anytime soon? What um, do you think? I mean, always, this, these are perfect product. I think. Yeah, of course. Um, I'm very open to expanding by um, still reaching um, to the same market base. Right. Actually, it's. Are, 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 are you trying to target the A market or the B market or C or D or E up to Z market? Okay, primarily again, it's my friends and the yeah. friends of friends. Yeah, who, if, it, if it is your friends, probably it's A. No, it no? of course not. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's for all. It, it's for everyone who likes to have exotic, something different, something a little classy. Okay, classy. But again, it's for everybody. Okay, so yeah. um, if people love it, why not? You know, I'm very open to um, doing a, bis a B2B relationship right. with others. If, I'm sure. I'm um, in, I, just so that you know also, mm -hmm. if for, for the people watching, if they want the pate, they can actually just call me and um, well, sure. me directly. I'm sure we can, or, we can arrange some. Yes, because I supply also to right. wine, okay. to, to a wine shop in Makati. Okay, uh, after a very short commercial, we are still going to talk about it. But, ladies and gentlemen, up next, we are going to have our very special guest, the owner of Sugar Dip. We'll be back.